Welcome everyone, my name is Jay Dominant, your money monkey is here and I'm doing a review again regarding a vaping product from Lazada and this product uh, is an RTA so I purchased this for the purpose of this review so I'll see you guys, just give me a second, I'll prepare everything Okay, so what's up YouTube, I'm back again and uh, yeah, I have an RTA here uh, again, I purchased this product uh, for the purpose of this review and I purchased this during the mid-year discount in Lazada. So yeah, I ordered this online and this is from Vape Play and Chill, VPAC. Okay, so this is an RTA and um, it's very popular nowadays. And this is, bam, Profile Unity, RTA. So yeah. But this is a clone actually. I didn't happen to purchase the original because it's expensive. I know. Okay, so I tried to uh, try to buy the clone one to check what are the what are the difference, okay, between the authentic and the the uh, this clone. Okay, so my friend actually have the Unity profile Unity, uh, which is an authentic. So I purchased the clone okay so but i didn't happen to borrow that one because he's using it okay and my cousin have a profile unity rda so there so well if you're on a tight budget you can get this one okay so that's v play and chill in lazada v pack okay i'll give you the uh you can check out their uh, Facebook page okay they have a lot of products there so um, they are very accommodating they respond um, they didn't respond on time or like as soon as they got my message but um, once they have time they will actually uh, reply in every message or in every questions that you have so for me uh, they're still very accommodating okay so VPAC good job okay so I actually shoot a video already, but I happened to erase that video so I can't find it anymore. So I have to do another video again. So here. Now, uh, I'm going to show you the up, up and close of this RTA. So let's dive down. Let's check it out. Profile. Unity. RTA. So here we go. This is Profile Unity RTA. Okay, so uh, this is the packaging or your box. Okay. These are the, actually the things that are included for the authentic. Okay, user manual, Japanese cotton, next mesh, one bag, but there's two pieces of it. Uh, glass tube adapter. Okay, so there's an adapter. Extra screws, mesh tool screwdriver extra o-rings and extension glass okay so those are the things that are included for the authentic okay and there your scratch and something okay so that's it okay there so if you open your box you're gonna get your uh, automizer here sitting here and then your extra, gla extra glass so this glass is actually uh, 3 ml juice capacity you can fit 3 ml juice capaci capacity in here but for the authentic one your extra glass is 5.5 ml of juice okay 5.5 ml juice capacity but since this is a clone you're not gonna get that so this is the same as with the pre-installed 3 uh, 3 ml okay as you can see okay and then uh, inside your box below you're gonna get your o-rings extra screws and your tool okay and your user manual so that's all inside this box so yeah, you're gonna get a coiling guide or a coiling guide. I mean, your mesh guide for the authentic. But this one, you're not gonna get that. That's it. You don't get an adapter, okay, to adjust 
or to extend or so you can use a 5.5 ml uh, juice glass no you're not gonna get that sir or ma'am okay. this is pretty much it that's it for your deck your chamber and this and uh, a drip tip oh by the way this drip tip it wasn't the one that comes with in this uh, clone uh, profile unity I just uh, used a different uh, different uh, 810 for this one okay uh, but that one is like uh, ceramic I think it's not uh, it's not smooth to be honest uh, hindi siya yung sasabihin mong may finishing na makintab no, para siyang cemento na ewan lang. Yeah. Pero, comfortable naman sa bibig. So, that's still good, okay? And also, your uh, your silicone here, manipis to. So, nagkakaroon pa rin ako ng leakage kahit ginagamit ko to. Kahit nakasarado to. Although, it's not actually leaking from here. No. Uh, I don't know kung bakit may lumalabas pa rin ijus. Lalo na kapag naka-upside down to. Yan. May leakage siya. So, I think that's natural. I'm, the, I'm not sure. Okay. So, plus you're seeing this. If I put it close up, just give me a second. I don't know if you can see this. There. This is the opening for where your cotton actually sucks all the juice okay and then there's another extra two holes here for the juice okay so all in all tatlo tatlong ano siya i mean six because you have one here uh, one cyclops here and one cyclops here and then two holes in each side that's it and this notch is actually for uh locking your your build up okay this one okay. so ang laki ng juice uh, opening niya so talagang kailangan niya ng maraming juice kasi you're using a mesh so you don't want to get a dry heat since mesh is really this and uh, this wide okay so this is also included uh, in your box uh, mesh coil but just one for the authentic you're gonna get two mesh coil okay but for this one just isa lang so pag nasira mo siya that's it that's why I purchase this okay this is 0.18 watt 45 to 65 wattage okay and I ordered this thing from juice junkie also in Lazada well good thing um, meron online kasi to be honest, mahirap humanap ng mesh coil sa mga vape shops it's either mabilis maubos or kasi konti lang naman yung kinukuha nilang ganito kasi hindi naman lahat nagme mesh coil okay, so medyo mahirap siya hanapin sa mga vape shop umikot ako sa Cubao and I didn't you know, I wasn't successful finding this kind of a uh, uh, this, finding this kind of a uh, coil, this mesh coil so what happened is order pa rin ako online. So, this is again from Juice Junkie. So, Juice Junkie, thank you so much. Okay? So, let's go to the build deck. So, this is your build deck spring-loaded. This is a clamp style uh, since you're using mesh. So, yan. Clamp style siya. Pero hindi to spring-loaded. Okay? So, this is your feeding slot or juice slot. Okay? Yan. Okay. So make sure you clean your deck or everything, your your automizer. Kasi yung mga machining and your machine oil, hindi mo alam, baka mahigog mo. So you have to clean all your automizers uh, pag branding, okay? So that's it. Nothing much. Okay? So yun. And this thing, hindi mo to malalock actually kapag nakalagay ito sa... Uh, sa mod mo. So, kailangan itanggalin mo muna siya. Kasi as you lock this thing, as you can see, umiikot din siya. Okay. 
ga-adjust din yung 510 pin niya. So, yun. And, another thing, since this is a clone, yung edges nito, sobrang talas, as you can see. Okay. So, kinalas ko ito ngayon. And, uh, yan. So, you have to be very careful with this one. This is very sharp. Yung edge niya. Okay. At the same time, may hirap siya ilock dahil siguro dun sa threading niya. So, ang hirap niya ilock, minsan sumasabit yung yung cotton ko kapag nilalock ko na. Okay. There. So, medyo may gap. I believe matatighten pa yan. So, pag hindi mo siya nasara ng husto, uh, minsan lumalabas yung juice dito. Okay. So, here's your airflow. So, whatever you adjust on this side, it's gonna be the same on the other side. Okay. There. So, yun. Nothing special with this one since this is a clone. But expect, uh, pag hindi ka marun mag beat nito, you're gonna get a lot of leakage for this. Leaking. Leaking issue. Dahil sa sobrang laki nung uh, juice opening niya. Kasi sobrang daming cotton nung kailangan mo for this mesh. Okay? So, sobrang daming kailangan mong cotton. So, ayun. Uh, pag pinuno mo to, sometimes... Uh, pag hindi proper yung wicking mo lalabas dito yung edges so nasasayo yung edges I did it so many times and uh, apparently I was successful finding the best uh, wicking for this one so what I used was the cotton bacon hindi ko tinitipid yung cotton nya kasi sobrang kailangan niyang dami ng juice okay so let's go back on top and uh, by the way uh, since you don't have a coil guide okay for this one you have to be resourceful okay maybe you can use the tool itself yung included na tool niya this one and uh yan lang ganyanin mo lang siya so yan mabibend na siya ng ganyan okay so ganun lang so mapaperfect pa natin to but uh, yeah so what I'm actually using my uh, mechanical pencil kasi yung buntot nun is uh, saktong sakto for my for for guiding this mesh coil so that that one since I don't have it uh, I'm using that one instead of this one but you can use this uh, it's working naman as you can see there I think pantay naman siya di ba Right? So there. So I'm gonna put a build on this. I'm gonna show you the performance. Uh, there's also a guide here. Kung paano mo siya iwiwik. So you can follow that or you can watch watch some videos kung paano nila winiwik to. But I can do it here. Though I'm gonna do uh, fast forward. Okay? So let's start. you have to be very careful pag sinikipan mo to kasi nalulus thread. Okay? Properly. Okay? Make sure you line this thing uh, properly. Oil. And if feeling mo is sobrang kapal niya. Okay? You can actually cut this. So, medyo ah, ano yung ohms niya. So, I think magiging something like 2 or point two or something but let's try that So, this one, this side, pupunta dito sa my juice slot. Okay. 
pupunta dito sa juice sa juice stop okay itong taas iwan mo na siyang ganyan you just have to cut it and then okay na nag-aapoy talaga siya. Sa totoo lang. So, you have to be very careful also when using this. Don't try to use it um, sa maximum uh, required na wattage niya. Okay? Like, what ka I suggest not to go 65 kasi nag-aapoy ito. Up and I'll show you the performance and my thoughts about this uh, Profile Unity RT8 clone. Okay, let's see, I have a lot of food. Okay, let's go back on top. So, there you go with the up and close for the Profile Unity RT8 mesh. Okay, and using the Watofo um, mesh coil. Okay, or mesh style coil. Okay, so again. This is from uh, Vplay and Chill, Vpack, uh, in Lazada. Check out all my videos. May review rin ako tungkol dito sa mod na to. This is a very amazing mod. And then, yeah. The coil, galing sa Juice Junkie. Thank you so much. You saved my life. Okay, so here's the performance. Okay, so performance, very cloudy, kita nyo naman, kasi it's, it's a mesh, and you're not gonna get a dry hit from this, kasi sobrang laki ng juice, ano niya, juice opening, so talagang higop lagi ng juice, pero dahil sa, na, ang kapal ng kota na gamit mo, expect na hindi tatagal yung, yung juice mo ng ilang hits kasi hihigupin niya ng hihigupin kaya minsan nagkakaroon ng leaking so far I'm not having leaking issue with the way I wick this uh, as I show you earlier hinahati ko yung cotton sa dalawang ano okay yung isa bangs yung isa hindi okay pero yan no leaking issue for this one and I don't suggest this for beginners Although maganda siya dahil in a sense na um, fix na yung um, uh, arms mo at the same time hindi ka na mahihirapan mag-build ng mag-build or mag-ikot ng mag-ikot ng, ng coil. So, it's okay. Pero you have to be very careful kung gag, lalo na sa beginner kasi umaapoy din to. Umaapoy ang mesh. So, kapag lumagpas ka ng wattage niya uh, ang tendency is mag-apoy siya. So, ikaw din ang uh, you know, we, we never know what will happen. Pero dahil umaapoy nga siya. You just have to be very careful. Okay? So, flavor for this one, amazing. Very amazing. Kahit clone to. So, yun lang. You have to be careful din kasi, like I've said, yan. Diba? May mga nakuha kong gas gas or and so may mga sugat na medyo mabab mababo lang naman dahil dun sa threading nya kasi masyadong sharp nga okay let me raise up this a bit yun at the same time I don't suggest this for new new uh, for beginners in vaping kasi um 
pag hindi ka marunong nung pagbibit niya, magdilik lang siya na maglilik at saka pwedeng masira yung mod mo dahil doon. So, we don't want that, okay? So, pero kung gagayahin niyo yung ginawa ko katulad kanina sa pagbibit, yan. Uh, talagang walang leaking. No dry heat. Sarap. Pati flavor, sarap. Sobra. So, yun. Pero, dahil nga clone siya, may mga hindi included dun sa box, which is the extender, uh, or the adapter. Okay. Uh, yeah. Glass tube adapter. Wala siya. The 5.5 ml extra glass. Wala siya. Uh, hindi sobra yun. Wala siyang extra mesh. So, isang mesh lang makukuha mo. So, pag nasira yun, um, wala na. You have to buy another uh, mesh coil. Which is, this is 250 for 10 pieces. Although it lasts very, very long. Okay? Uh, and the pl flavor naman is masarap. Okay? Kaya lang mahirap siya hanapin sa mga vape shop. Kaya, o oh, order ka talaga online. So, yun. If you try to put a build on this, the ordinary coil, pwede naman. But I don't suggest 3mm. I don't suggest 3mm kasi sa sobrang laki ng juice slot niya or juice opening niya, kailangan mo sobrang kapal na cotton dito. So, dahil lang airflow nito ay is nandito lang, not on top, hindi katulad ng Kylin M, nasa top. Ito kasi nandito. So, bababa lang ng bababa yung juice, mapaflood yung, yung loob ng deck mo at lalabas dito yung juice. So, yun. So, kung gagamit ka ng ordinary coil for this, uh, I suggest mas mataas sa 3mm. Okay? 3mm. Kasi sobrang, kailangan mo ng sobrang maraming maraming cotton for this. Okay? At ano pa ba? Mm, the coil guide for your mesh, wala kang ganon. Aside from, isa lang yung mesh mo is mahirapan ka pang maghanap pati ng mesh coil. So, online lang. So, yung coil guide mo for your mesh, hindi kasama yun. So, another thing pagdating sa clone, okay? You can't have the same privilege as the authentic, okay? Pero yun. So, you have to be very ready for what what you see is what you get. That's it. Since this is a clone. Yun lang siya. Pero, uh, the price for 522, uh, it's worth it naman din. It's worth it uh, kasi kung hanap mo is flavor and then uh, performance kayang kaya niya kahit clone siya okay pero for that price may mabibili na rin kayong authentic na RDA or RTA I believe so yon uh, good thing about this kasi as sa sub ohm tank kasi papalitan mo talaga yung 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 sub ohm head niya or yung coil head niya. So, unlike for this one, dahil rebuildable siya, coil lang hahanapin mo, or yung ordinary coil, pwede mong gamitin dito. Okay? Kailangan nga lang malaki. Pero yun, uh, sa so sub ohm kasi, hindi mo, pwede mo buildan, katulad ng video na ginawa ko nung the last time. I do have that video na nag-build ako sa loob ng isang sub ohm uh, coil head. Yun, pwede mong gawin yun if you want to. Pero, ito kasi, uh, gamitin mo ordinary coil or mesh, okay na. Plus, the mesh, tumatagal to, hindi lang tatlong buwan or hindi lang apat na buwan, I believe. Kaya ito, kahit lima, siguro, or more. Okay? I'm not sure. Pero, yun yung tingin ko. Kasi, uh, onting fire lang, okay? Ano siya? Malinis ulit ka agad yung coil niya. Okay? Pero, just make sure na pag finire nyo sa, sa mababang wattage lang. Okay, like what I did earlier, nasa 13 watt lang siya kasi pag sobrang taas, I, I'm not sure what's going to happen, pero they suggest na yun ang gagawin. Huwag itataas at umaapoy nga siya. Okay? Flavor pati sobrang sarap. Kung anong lasa ng e-juice mo, malalasa mo. Blueberry... Uh, pancake, milky, um, nalalasaan ko siya. Sobrang sarap. Okay. 
So, yun lang. So, for vape play and shield, salamat sobra ng marami sa Profile Unity Mesh. Uh, very accommodating sila. Sa Juice Junkie, salamat ng marami din sa coil, sa mesh coil. Sobrang salamat. And also, ano pa ba? Yeah, uh, FDA is targeting vapors today all around the world. So, let's do our part para makatulong sa vaping community. Okay, para makontinue natin yung yung kinahihiligan nating vaping. Okay, and also uh, let's not bash each, each other kasi alam mo yun, vaping is to help people, especially smokers, para mag-quit sila sa smoking and mag-switch sa vaping or totally mag-stop sila sa anumang vision na meron sila. Okay, so yun, rather than bashing, magtulungan po tayo ang vaping is hindi lang po sa may yaman or sa may pera, okay? Of course, kailangan mo ng pera para makabili. Pero, syempre, tulungan natin yung mga smokers na gustong mag-quit, okay? And, uh, I don't know how you, how are you, how are you going to do that, but, um, yeah, rather than bashing them, help them, okay? And, also, ano pa ba? Mm, be respectful. Be responsible vapor. Don't vape where you can smoke uh, you know your arms law, okay? Vaping is not to make yourself look cool, okay? This is to help you to quit on smoking, okay? So that's it. For, for, especially, um, yung mga minors, let's not, uh, let's not tolerate them or wag natin i-entertain pagdating sa vaping kasi it's not good naman din na dahil, dahil lang nakikita ang mga minor eh may vaping product eh pwede na sila uh, you know, lalo, lalo tayong magiging target ng gobyerno. So let's do our part naman din. And pretty much it. That's it. Okay? So thank you for watching. If you find this video helpful, please hit the like button. If not, thumbs down. That's okay. And then uh, uh, subscribe to my channel. Okay? If you find this helpful. Okay, and um, always be a responsible vapor and keep on vaping. And stay happy, healthy, and live to the fullest. Okay, so see you guys next time and peace out.